All right, it's the Brooker Without Gratitude guy today with my special guest, Chris Carlson, also known as the sales coach. And of course, for those of you that watch these videos, you know that what's the number one question? Chris, what are you grateful for? Uh, first of all, thanks for having me, David. And, and I would say it's, can I say it's two things? Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> and, and what they really are is first, my family. I'm blessed to have a great wife and two wonderful children who I couldn't be more proud of. And so it really makes my business life easier when I have those people in my life. Mm. And they allow me to do the things that I am, want to do in my life Great. without questioning me and, and always being on my case, if you will. Mm -hmm. And then the second thing is just having great business associates mm. uh, like yourself who we can have Thank conversations you. and talk about the good things that are happening and sometimes the things that are not so good and then work on those problems. And then also what those great business associates do is they refer you to people. Absolutely. And that makes your business life so much easier. So I think it's what I have found over the years that if, if both of those functions are going well, uh, they bleed into each other. Oh, so if you have excellent. a good business life, you take it home. And if you have a good uh, personal life, you take it to work. Right. And when it gets out of whack and nothing's perfect in life, and sometimes it does, it, it, they affect both of them. Mm -hmm. But right now, I am so grateful that both of them are hitting on all eight cylinders. Well, it's great too. Chris kind of talks about, I like to divide our world sometimes into professional and personal. And he says, can I give you two things? Absolutely, one's professional, one's personal. So I feel so strongly about gratitude and of course the gratitude journal and that type of thing, both with the family and with those friends, as you just said, that you're grateful to have. Do you feel you do a good job of expressing to them how grateful you are to have them in your life? <laughs> I wish I could tell you that I was outstanding at that, but I probably get caught up like most people is. Sometimes I can take them for granted, so it was a great reminder right. for me to go home tonight and make right. sure I tell them I'm grateful for them. Excellent. So those future guests, remember, I won't reprimand you on anything on the video. So I just wanted to remind Chris <laughs> that we got to tell these people we're grateful for. Those of you that have seen the talk, we do the little thing where we text people and let them know how grateful we are for them. So that's it for now. Chris Carlson, my current guest. Tune in next week. We'll have another special guest. Thanks for listening to the Brooker That Gratitude Guy. And thank you, Chris. Thank you, Deb. You bet.